what is up guys it's been a little minute but i'm back been busy with the family i had to take care of some personal business and you know how job is it's always hectic so i'm trying to make sure everything falls in place and when i come here i make sure i make great videos for you guys to watch so today's video uh, i'm definitely going to show you guys a new paint for you guys that's new i have a 2006 subaru wrx sti hawkeye edition and to me that's the best body style of the subaru family so long story short the car needed a paint for the longest so i finally got that i'm gonna show you guys that that something that I, ha I haven't noticed the whole time that I had the car, believe it or not, uh, radiator cap and the uh, the reservoir, the cooling reservoir cap. I got those OEM, the ones that I have on the car for a while. It wasn't OEM. It, it did its job, but I definitely wanted to get OEM. Show the paint, put the mats on, and I'm definitely gonna do the caps. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna bring that car outside a little bit so you guys can check it out. So before I show you guys the car, it is pollen season here in Georgia. So I'm definitely going to show you guys the whole car and what was wrong with it, like as far as the paint. So let's start with the mirror. This mirror right here and the other mirror, it was like so uh, peeling off, like the, the clear coat was saw is all messed up. So as you guys see, it's not anymore. If you've seen the videos before and you definitely know what I'm talking about, if you're new to the channel, definitely go back and watch a couple videos and check that out uh what i'm talking about another thing was the hood the hood was the main thing as far as it was very very ugly the clear coat it was so gone that you know it, it's definitely a big change from what it was to it is right now the front bumper was another part of the car that was peeling off like the whole entire front bumper watch the video like i said and you guys will know what i'm talking about uh, the ones that are new to the channel, check that out also. And like I said, both mirrors was bad. See, this one is perfect now. It was really bad all the way here to the quarter panel, all the way here. It was very bad. Right here where this black piece is at, all that was uh, chrome. The spoiler in the back of the car, it was pretty mint the last time before it got painted. So that still looks good. Like the side of the car, everything, you know, like it was like very... Uh, it was very bad, but like I said, it just like, it looks so much better now because it was time, it was overdue, so I had to get it done. So speaking of flow mats, uh, the four pieces are inside this plastic, so let's go to the car, I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about. So long story short, when I had bought this car, this piece was under the plastic here. See, it was here the whole time. I have not noticed that I'd never had a floor mat under there it was crazy like this whole time i'm not making this up it's funny so like i say I, I barely drove the car of course i noticed that i had a, a floor mat here i found out this mat right here is for the passenger side what's the driver side at nowhere to be found so i'm like are you serious so that's when i came about i need to get some floor mats oem brand new that's something that was overdue i didn't notice until the last minute so here i am I'm about to throw this out right now. Trash. So I'm gonna take all these out of plastic and I'm gonna compare it to this one right here to see how different it is as far as uh, how it looks. It's definitely gonna look way better. But I don't think I'm going to throw this one away because all, all it needs is a good cleaning and maybe someone down the line might need one, you never know. And you know, so I might just keep it around. That's a big difference right there. So I'm definitely excited that I'm getting OEM stuff for the car. I'm going to go ahead and install the radiator cap and the reservoir cap, the OEM. So I did the radiator one. Now is the reservoir one. A little addition to the engine bay. Clean, clean. So I gotta, I'll probably, like I said, I'm not, I might not even throw these out either. Or in the meantime, I had, I had got two belts, uh, two brand new belts. I got this belt right here. 
the alternator belt and the AC belt. So both of them are brand new. I had got a brand new oil cap right here, OEM, a oil dipstick. Um, the reason I switched these two is because uh, the old ones they was really old and they just changed the color. It was like almost almost like brownish in this one too. So that's why I changed those things. So for the next thing, like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and do some mild soap and wash the car really quick. since it's still polar season I just go ahead and just spray the car with water and because if I wash it it's just gonna get dirty right right back so I definitely just did that for now so there's two spots that I can go to the first one I'm gonna see about this church uh, parking lot first and then if that don't work out we're gonna go to the uh, there's a park which is almost 10 minutes away but the um, the church parking lot is like right around the corner. Man, the car is like, it didn't run this good when I first got it. It was like, it was very, very horrible. It was just like, I don't, I don't know how to explain it. It was bad, you know, it's like, I don't know. You guys that are new to the channel have to uh, go back to the, maybe to the first video um, to see what I'm talking about. It was like, I couldn't even drive it like this far, you know, and it was crazy. Some of you guys know that I briefly had a motorcycle on the channel. Um, it really wasn't for the channel that I have, it just for personally for myself and for me to take my girl to, you know, like the mountains and go riding and stuff like that. It's something that was temporary. So what I'm trying to say is the bike is gone. I tried to trade it for a car so I could have another car on the channel, but the thing was nobody wanted to trade it. They all wanted to buy it because it's about that time that everybody wants a bike. So I really wanted to trade it so I don't have to get the money and then buy a car because long story short, it's too much. It's like, it's a headache. Like I sold the bike, but I'm having a hard time to buy a car because I was specifically on the edge telling what I want as a trade so nobody I guess nobody have the cars that I want that they all want to buy so the bike is sold so I'm asking you guys what you guys think about 
what kind of car should I put next on the channel? Let me know ASAP. Just comment down below. Let me know because I, I need to know because I've been looking for the cars that I want, but I haven't found nothing. So whatever you guys want to see on the channel, let me know so maybe I can get lucky and maybe, you know, I can have something new on the channel. Like I said, make sure you like this video. And like I said earlier on the video, everybody that didn't see how the paint was, it was horrible. Make sure you guys go back to a couple videos, three or four videos, and you guys will see all the way to the beginning, how the car was running. I literally couldn't even pull the driveway without the car dying. It was always dying, smoking. It, it was horrible. So from, I came from that to where, where it's at now, it's a big change. So I definitely want to get you guys' opinion on uh, what should I do next to the SCI. I kind of need to keep it OEM. I wanted to keep it original because I don't want to mod modify it too much because this car is going up in value. I want to make sure that I get the most money if I do sell in the future, so I don't want to modify it really heavy. With that being said, for the new subscribers, make sure you comment down below. Make sure you like this video. Make sure you let me know the subscribers from day one, which is like about two years ago, to the subscriber this, this week, last week, today. Make sure anybody let me know what kind of car should I put in this channel. For that being said, thank you for watching this video. Stay tuned. Plenty of videos is coming next. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up this video like plastic. So I'll see you guys on the next one. Yeah, buddy.